first aid for a neurological emergency will depend on the specific condition or situation. However, here are some general steps to follow when faced with a neurological emergency. Assess the situation. Ensure your safety and the safety of the person experiencing the emergency. Determine if the person is conscious and responsive. Call for emergency medical assistance. Dial the emergency number in your country, such as 9010056444 or 9010057444, to request an ambulance. Provide clear and accurate information about the situation, including the nature of the neurological emergency. Stay with the person. Remain with the person and provide reassurance. Keep them calm and help them feel as comfortable as possible. Protect the person from further injury. Ensure the person is in a safe environment, free from hazards or objects that may cause harm. If necessary, gently guide or support the person to prevent falls or further injury. Preserve the person's airway. If the person is conscious but having difficulty breathing or their airway is compromised, assist them in maintaining an open airway. Do not force anything into their mouth. Control bleeding, if present. If there is bleeding due to a head injury or other trauma, apply direct pressure to the bleeding area using a clean cloth or your hand, if necessary. Minimize movement. Depending on the situation, it may be best to minimize the person's movement to prevent exacerbation of any potential spinal or neurological injury. Do not provide food or drink. Unless directed by medical professionals, avoid giving the person anything to eat or drink. Provide relevant information to medical professionals. When emergency medical personnel arrive, provide them with accurate information about the person's symptoms, any known medical conditions, and any first aid measures you have taken. It's important to note that first aid for a neurological emergency should only be provided within your level of training and capabilities. It's always recommended to seek immediate medical attention in these situations and follow the guidance of healthcare professionals.